One last question, Angel. Do the words kiss the blood mean anything to you? No. Sounds sick to me. You're not in the clear by any means, Angel. You're going back into a cell. You should think about whether you have anything else you need to share with us. You think the vice boys get any on the side? I say we bust in there and find the guy doing that thing. <laughs> What's your read on Maldonado? I still like him for us. Seriously, that line about the guy at the fruit market making eyes at his woman? Please. We'll get to the market and the guy behind the counter will tell us he saw Angel drag his old lady off into the night. This case will be shut like all the others. Bag was left just up there, overlooking the market. Could have come here from the start and saved ourselves a day's legwork. I just don't know how to dance to bebop. LAPD, Detective Phelps and Galloway. Clem Feeney, what can I do for you? Did you happen to see a young woman last night, 21 years old, Hispanic? Sure, she came by last night. Why do you ask? She was wearing a necklace? I didn't notice. You weren't paying attention, Feeney? Hey, you're getting the wrong idea. Looking exactly how inside. much fruit do you sell here after midnight, Clem? Uh, look, not much. I sell the odd bottle on the side to the after hours crowd. But I don't want any trouble. I'm just trying to make a buck. The young lady. Arrived around midnight? Yeah, something like that. Used the phone for a cab and then left. You already knew Mrs. Maldonado, didn't you, Clem? Sure, I met her before. She seemed like a nice lady. Her husband went apeshit one day when he caught me talking to her. She hadn't been back until last night. Where did she go from here? She wanted a cab, but I couldn't get her one. I was about to offer to drive her, but a car pulled up, and she got into that. Can you describe the car? Brown Ford Coupe, I think. She seemed to know the guy. Do you mind if we look around? Why would you want to do that? Because we say so. I guess you can. Don't you have to get a court order or something? I have rights. Clem? Shh. No wonder he stays open late at night. People have to get their vitamins. Check through this stuff before we get back out there. So what are we hiding in here? This thing needs a combination. Oh, fuck. Two, five, three. I got a call back from... 
that universal chorus line. cut someone who was already dead. It's a typical power thing. Once the stiff is dead, the creep usually feels they can do whatever they like. You must have seen it during the... This fruit skull punk gets about 10 seconds to explain before I pull his fucking arms off. Cliff! Damn it, get after him, Cole. I'm trying to shoot out his tires. Wish me luck. Hit it. Clean this asshole off the road. We should have grabbed him when we had the chance, Phelps. When we had the chance, we didn't know he was our guy. Phelps, you gotta get me closer. Strange that he'd keep a trail of blood right back to his own market. Maybe he wanted to be caught. A lot of them do. Oh, fuck. It's almost too perfect, isn't it? There's no such thing as too perfect. Almost lost him, lost him there. Now who's about to get picked? Keep it steady and I'll try to bust his tires! Well then shoot. Keep yourself up! Now! Sick man, Clem. You need help. Outstanding job on this case, gentlemen. The poor woman can now rest in peace. I'll pay the fiend a personal visit myself and remind him that crime in this city does not go unpunished. When they finish with him at the receiving hospital, we'll have him up before the grand jury. I have a meeting this afternoon with the mayor, lads. I'll be sure to mention your names. Now, on your way. Everyone's drinking. those saving <laughs>